do, 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 do sound. It's got to be a new lethal weapon movie, right? I told you, you're not welcome here. Oh, looks like the bot keeps a real grouch. Maybe Riggs owes him money. Wait, that ain't Riggs. That's Wolverine. And is that Deadpool? He's spouting gibberish about Wolverine needing to join his little hero squad. Wolfie bless his grumpy heart tells him to get bed. Apparently Deadpool throws down the you let everyone down card. News flash Sparky Wolverine ain't buying it. Tells Deadpool to take a hike and points him towards a good old fashioned brawl. Maybe the only therapy he understands. And all these weirdos are walking around in circles outside talking about a bunch of junk. Seems they're out that they're element in some time travel mess. But here's the real shocker, Jerry. Wolverine's from a world where all the X-Men are kaput. Poof, gone. Now that's a downer. But the red fella, somehow he slipped out of this time travel jail. Slippery fella, that one. To be honest, I never watched Loki season 2. Did Deadpool just get stabbed in the nutsack? Wolverine is getting shot in the sides right where I used to hate getting tickled. That's gotta be rough. Man, Ryan Reynolds really does look like a ball sack. Didn't TJ Miller say that in one of the previous movies? Whatever happened to that guy? Didn't he call a bomb threat on a train? That was awesome. I gotta say, finally seeing Wolverine in that yellow outfit really does look awesome. But didn't he say he was never gonna play Wolverine again? I wonder if he changed his mind because of that badass suit, or maybe his wife didn't want him to make any more movies. But didn't they get divorced recently? Wait a minute. Do you think Hugh Jackman got divorced so he could make this movie? Maybe they will get back together now that it's over? Honestly, I haven't seen most of the X-Men movie, but that Logan movie kicked ass. He was going around stabbing everyone in the head while Professor X was setting off giant earthquakes with his brain seizures or something, I don't know. The version of the movie I watched was completely in black and white. Probably shouldn't have bought it from that bootleg guy down by the bus station. Why the heck is a man's giant face opening up like that? And what's up with all these Mad Max car scenes? I freaking love those movies. I don't care if it's Tom Hardy or Mel Gibson, just give me rugged men in torn leather driving wild rides in dusty sand. This broads Professor X's evil twin, Cassandra Nova. Sounds like a fancy name for a real nasty piece of work. Oh boy, are they jumping into one of those Doctor Strange round portal things? I don't know if that's cool or dumb, but they're doing it all right. Okay, okay, you'll pay up. I knew it. This isn't lethal weapon. This is Deadpool and Wolverine. Turns out everyone's favorite regenerating mercenary has a weakness. Blind eye. Yep, there she is trying to shove some nose candy up Deadpool's mask, but the mask with her mouth keeps saying no. Even disco dust. White girl interrupt. So what do you think, Jerry? Time travel evil twins and a team up between Wolverine and the Red Fella. This movie's got it all. 